Hi everyone. In this video, I will show you how to create this whale typography in Adobe Illustrator. First, create a new document with these dimensions. Now I need a whale silhouette, for this, I am going to search for it on the internet. Type in the search bar, whale silhouette. Click on images. I am going to use this silhouette for my typography. Right click on it and choose copy image. Go back to Illustrator and press Ctrl plus V to paste it here. Go to the object menu and lock or press Ctrl plus 2 to lock this. Change the outline color to a different from the background and silhouette. I am using red color. Go to the pen tool and trace it. Follow me in that process. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus 2 to unlock the image. And delete it. Here is the shape of the whale that I use for typography. Change its outline to fill. And can keep or change the color to your preference, I'll be switching it to black. Here I need few minor adjustments to the shape. Follow the process. Now use the pen tool to create separation lines. Follow me in that process. Hold the ALT button to make a copy of this so that if there are any mistakes, we can use it. Now select these lines and shapes, go to the object menu, and expand. Open the Pathfinder panel and click on the Divide button. Double click on the shape, and select the black part with the help of the magic tool. Then go to the edit menu and click on cut. Press Ctrl plus A to select all and hit delete. And then paste it in front. Now we have this shape in parts. Here I need to create further parts. Now select the Type tool and type your text. Change its case to Upper. Right click on it and choose Create Outline. And then Ungroup. Now select the shapes, right click on them, arrange and bring them to the front. Now select the letter W and the first part of the whale. Go to the object menu, envelope distort then make with the top object or press alt plus ctrl plus c. And repeat it with the next one.
Now select these shapes and expand them. We need modifications to achieve a flawless appearance. Use a direct selection tool for it. Follow me in that process. And that's it. Share your thoughts on this. If there is any question, you can ask in the comment section. Make sure you head over to my YouTube channel, where I upload graphic related tutorials. Thank you for watching.